The European Parliament on Tuesday voted to standardize the charging port on electronic items. Once this becomes the law, all mobile phones, tablets and cameras sold in the EU must have a USB-C port by the end of 2024. Laptops are also part of the list, but the deadline for manufacturers is set for spring 2026. The European Parliament has said that regardless of their manufacturer, all new mobile phones, tablets, digital cameras, headphones and headsets, handheld video game consoles and portable speakers, e-readers, keyboards, mice, portable navigation systems, earbuds and laptops that are rechargeable via a wired cable operating with a power delivery of up to 100 watts will have to be equipped with a USB type C port. USB C is not new. Its specifications were first published in 2014. Yet its adoption has picked pace only in recent years. Unlike its previous iterations, the USB-C has a small oval port with no fixed up or down orientations. Its symmetrical connector makes it easy to plug in. Besides the ease of use, what really makes USB-C the gold standard of charging ports is its ability to support fast charging and super fast data transfers using a single cable. Not just data and power, USB-C also supports sending simultaneous video signals of up to 8K resolution. So does your phone's existing USB-C port support all this? It depends. You may already have a USB-C port on your device but still cannot use all features and functions such as host device charging and video out. It is because different manufacturers use USB-C for different utilities. To get around this challenge, the EU has made it mandatory for the manufacturers of electronic items to put a dedicated label to inform consumers about the charging characteristics of new devices. So, how will it affect different manufacturers of electronic devices around the world? USB-C was developed by the USB Implementers Forum, a group of companies that has in its membership big technology brands such as Microsoft, Apple, Samsung, HP, and Dell. While most tech companies have moved to USB-C, Apple is still to make a move as far as its iPhone and AirPods lines are concerned. It now has a 2-year window in which it needs to move its devices to USB-C. According to Apple analysts, the company might launch an iPhone with a USB-C port in September 2023. The European Parliament said that disposed of and unused chargers account for about 11,000 tons of e-waste annually in the EU. Imagine the worldwide figure and how this new law, if implemented across the globe, will help in reducing e-waste. And when can India move to a world with just one kind of charging port? India too has considered the idea of a single charger for all electronic devices. The Union Ministry of Consumer Affairs has written to industry players to devise a plan for having one cable for charging all your devices if manufacturers move to a world with only usb c ports because of changes in european laws then india will also not be unaffected you may finally get over the hassle of finding different chargers for your devices if you like this video share it and subscribe to business standard For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.